Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can probably tell from the title and the thumbnail and what's behind me, today's video is going to be a grocery haul, um, which you guys seem to like and a lot of you have been messaging me to do these weekly, which I might do, I'm going to give it a try. Um, so today I got groceries from Tesco, which um, I have been getting from them in the past few weeks and I'm actually really liking their service and the prices. So um, today is actually Wednesday, which is the day that I usually order on because it's the cheapest and someone's stealing my groceries again, but yeah, on Wednesday it's the cheapest at around noon. So that's when I got my groceries delivered and it was two pounds for delivery, which I think is really good. Um, and I'm going to share with you the total at the end as usual I'm going to show you an overview of everything and you guys can leave me a guess in the comments below as to how much you think it costs I think it's always fun to see your guesses. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. This is everything that I got I got uh, food. Um, oh, I'm going to show you my meal plan actually first But I've got obviously food for the week. We are a family of three if you don't know I have a husband <laughs> and a toddler so um, these are all of the meals for us for breakfast lunch dinner um, some snacky bits and then and I also got I think you can see over there I've got uh, diapers I've got laundry detergent and things like that let me go and grab my meal plan really quick okay this week we've got five dinners planned um, and I have chili tacos so I got some uh, taco shells like the soft kind and some uh, meat and veggies for the chili second meal is pasta with salmon peas and cheddar um, or parmesan. I actually got both so I'm going to see how it goes but this recipe is actually from Mrs. Meldrum. Um, I found that recipe on her Instagram. I think she shared it one night so I just kind of screenshotted that. So I'm gonna give it a try because she always raves about that recipe. And then uh, third recipe is uh, veggie sausages with potatoes. The reason why I put this in the, on the list is because I saw the veggie sausages on offer um, on Tesco this week and I thought we would give them a try. Um, and then we have chicken breast with corn and rice and then the last recipe is bruschetti which um, I haven't done in a while and I'm actually really missing making those in the oven so yeah those are my meals for this week so let's go ahead and have a look at all of the groceries and I'm actually thinking of filming a what's for dinner this week as well so that you can see how I actually make all of these recipes so yeah you guys will see that video separately as well okay this is an overview so starting from here we've got veggies meat um, some fridge stuff you guys can leave me your guesses in the comments right now as to how much you think this all cost okay starting from here we've got raspberries I just got the Tesco kind because they were on offer as well um, and then I got some bananas um, I actually still have a few bananas left from last week and I'm going to make banana bread with those but we always like to have bananas on hand and then I also got a couple of fruits that we haven't had in a while so I got flat peaches from Tesco as well these looked really good and I got some plums as well the ripen at home kind um, and then over here in the back I've got some lettuce because I'm going to use that probably with the chili um, tacos or just you know on the side for like a salad. I got the Haas kind of avocados. Um, I actually mentioned this before and I have tried them from Tesco and I think they are the best from the ones that I've tried so far. Um, they are really delicious. I saw these small sweet corn cobs and I thought I would give them a try so I'm going to do um, I think this will go with the chicken uh, recipe and um, I actually didn't buy chicken breast because I already have that in my freezer um, and then over here uh, I've got let's see I've got carrots I bought three carrots because we always use them in different recipes and I've got baby plum tomatoes because again these are always nice to have as a side um, and then two red onions I think I'm going to use one of them for the chili and then we'll see but I always like to have some if you hear that noise that's what it is <laughs> I always like to have one of these on hand and I bought some British shallots um, this is what Mrs. Meldrum used for that recipe so I thought I would give it a try and I'm actually going to use um, shallots in some other uh, recipes as well and then oh, over here I've got Pizza Express they had half off for Pizza Express and I've never tried them before so I'm gonna give them a go I got the margarita and the American classic American pepperoni pizza these sound really good and I'm going to pop them in the freezer and I think sometimes you just need a frozen pizza in your life <laughs> okay for meats I've got a turkey mince I want to make the chili with this I'm kind of trying not to have beef anymore I just like it doesn't really 
I don't know, I just don't crave it anymore. So I'm going to use this instead. And then I'm going to use some salmon. I'm going to make one night, you know, with the pasta, with peas and stuff. And I actually have the peas in the freezer as well. So I didn't buy those. Um, and I got just like two boneless uh, salmon fillet because I feel like that's a good portion for uh, myself and my husband. And Victor's going to have a little bit as well. Um, and it's kind of, you know, it's plenty for the three of us. Then I got two of these uh, wafer thin uh, honey roast hemp slices. These are always nice in sandwiches or, um, you know, just to have on hand. Um, and they were any two for three pounds, which I think is a pretty good offer. And then I got Linda McCartney's uh, six vegetarian sausages, which I'm so excited to try. Um, I don't know, they sounded really good and they were also on offer. Um, so yeah, this is going to be one night for dinner. And then I got two of these mature cheddar uh, from Tesco. Uh, this is the shredded kind, which is going to be really good for pasta or even sandwiches. And I got two of them because again, I think they were buy one, get one free or they were on offer. I can't remember. Either way, they were a good price. And I got two of these sal slightly salted butter um, because we always use butter in recipes or for breakfast and you just gotta have some butter. Um, and then I got creme fraiche because um, I'm going to use this for the salmon pasta with peas recipe. And then I got sour cream to serve with the chili tacos. And then uh, over here we've got parmigiano, just some regular parmesan, which I'm going to grate myself. I feel like parmesan tastes so much better when you grate it yourself. Um, maybe it's just me, <laughs> but that's how I like um, my parmesan cheese on pasta. And I got soft tortillas because I figured um, I would better get the soft kind um, so that Victor can have them as well because if, if they're crunchy, I don't think um, it's going to be too easy for him to eat. I just got the soft ones and I thought these would be really interesting because I've never seen these. They're kind of like a boat um, and they hold your uh, filling much better. So yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of excited to use this up. And I got vegetable stock. Um, organic vegetable stock for the pasta recipe and I'm going to probably use this in a few other recipes as well um, and then over here I'm going to hide these really quickly <laughs> because I got three veg straws and someone's obsessed with them and if he sees them he's gonna want to eat them so gonna put them in the cupboard really quickly okay stashed those away <laughs> and now I'm going to show you the rest so I've got Pesco 12 free range eggs um, because we like to have eggs in the morning or I'm, I will make some banana bread and then sometimes I make uh, little pancakes for Victor so we always like to have some eggs um, in our fridge then over here we've got some canned things and just kind of like cupboard items so this is a mild chili powder that I got from Tesco um, and this is going to go with our uh, chili tacos dish obviously and then sweet corn, uh, I've got this also for the tacos. And then I got beans, the no added sugar type of beans for the tacos. Um, actually, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use these or these. Um, gonna have to see. But I got some red kidney beans as well. Um, got two Napolina chopped tomatoes. You guys know we love these and we use them a lot, um, a lot in recipes. I got some apricot jam because I'm going to have this um, for breakfast probably. And then some Nutella. This is what my husband re requested. <laughs> You guys let me know if your significant others are like this as well. But I asked my husband, you know, what would you like for dinner this week? Or do you have any requests for meals? And he's like, oh, just add me a Nutella on the list. Like, is that even a meal? <laughs> okay, moving on. We've got roasted garlic rice. I love this stuff. It's definitely not the healthiest for you, but I love having that once in a while. So I'm gonna have two of those in my cupboard for rainy days. <laughs> And then over here I've got plain flour because I want to have these for um, making pancakes. I already have self-raising flour which I'm going to use for uh, banana bread. And then I've got some granulated sugar because I only use this for my coffee in the morning but um, yeah I was running out of that. And then over here we've got almond milk for my husband. He usually likes to drink almond milk. Um, sometimes I do too, but um, I'm not really too fast. Like I will have the regular milk as well. Then I got two of these Tropicana Smooth Orange Juice. We love this in the morning. Um, and then I got two bottles of milk. 
these are mostly for Victor just like the Tesco whole milk kind and um, these are the huge bottles because he drinks quite a lot of milk still got this kind of spirally pasta because um, my toddler loves this I think he kind of recently discovered these and he loves having them so um, I'm just going to you know ride that wave and just give him what he wants so I'm just going to make different types of sauce with that and it's really nice because you can hide a lot of veggies in the sauce and I got some crumpets from Warburton's because um, I want to have these for breakfast so I'm gonna have crumpets with that apricot jam and I think it's going to be a really quick and easy um, breakfast I got a white toasty um, and then I got two of these because I'm going to make that uh, bruschetti so um, I wanted to have this and just kind of slice it up and put it in the oven it's going to be really really delicious and I actually didn't buy bagels this time because uh, we already have them <laughs> we already have both the seeded kind and just the plain Warburton ones and then this is the shame corner <laughs> I'm just kidding but we got the Doritos we got the tangy cheese kind because I really like those I think they are really delicious and then I got Mr. Kipling Cakes. I actually turned this around because for some reason there was a label with my address on it um, and my name. So, um, yeah. Um, but I got the apple, blackcurrant and cherry pies. Um, I, I don't know, they sounded good and I want to give them a try. Then I got some Unstoppables uh, for scenting your laundry. This smells really good. Um, I tried smelling all of them in store because they have little openings here. And this one is the one that smelled the best to me. And I got Fairy Non-Bio uh, Detergent for Laundry. I got the big bottle because um, obviously we're going to use that anyway. So might as well get the big bottle. And then we got some Pampers Snappy Pants in size 6. These are the ones that we use for Victor at the moment. Um, and I got the big pack of 52 because we are actually running really low. Like I think I have only about 3 diapers left. <laughs> So we were really waiting for this Tesco delivery um, and then I got another set of coke because you guys know I will have one every once in a while in the evening. So uh, that's everything that I got. Um, as I mentioned I do have a couple of bits um, in my fridge and freezer as well. These groceries will last us throughout the week. I think the only thing that I usually buy throughout the week um, if we run out is milk and bread. That's about it. We're usually pretty good sticking to the meal plan. Um, so yeah, this is everything that I got. I'm going to share with you the total. Let me see. Um, so I did have one substitution for the chili powder, but it was okay. Without the delivery, it was 97 pounds. So 97 pounds for all of the groceries, and then delivery was two pounds. So the total was 99 pounds. I think it's a pretty good value for money. So I hope you guys found this helpful or entertaining. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!